um, what I should um, let you know are um, are some measures to make sure that this doesn't happen. The first measure is to make sure when you're saving documents that you are saving to the My Documents folder in specific folders by yourself um, frequently. So save frequently, save to specific folders based on what you're working on. If it's a business and it's a marketing document, put it into a business folder. In that folder, create a folder, save the document in that folder. Okay? So, um, and when you're in that, when you're writing the document, you save frequently. You know, every five, you know, every few minutes or so, you write a couple paragraphs, you hold control and hit the S key. By default, that is the, um, the hot keys to save. So, control S. It should just be a part of your, your, um, you know, your typing. Your typing, control S, boom. You know? It's, it's, it's a simple thing, but people don't do it, and they mess themselves up. Now, there's also a problem with everything that I just said. <laughs> the, the problem is, is that all of this information is local. What I mean by local is that it's on your machine. Now, when I go here to my documents folder, you know, I have I have files here, you know, I have, you know, just as I, I, I suggested to you all, I have a, um, a business folder there, you know. So the problem with that, what happens if this computer that I have right here gets stolen? What happens if this um, computer that I'm using is caught in a fire? Um, that is a problem having everything that you work on on your specific hard drive on your physical hard drive that's a problem so what I suggest is to um, if you're going to you know be using word that you also um, up, upload your folders or I'm sorry your documents to either Zoho or Google Docs. These are um, actual, you know, um, just as Word and Excel, it's the same thing. Um, it works in the same way where uh, you can write documents um, online and um, you can share them. They actually has a lot of benefits that I won't go into. I do have some videos that explain all that. But uh, what this gives you over all of that is the fact that you're not, um, when, once you've uploaded your documents that are from your, your computer onto the service, it's in what's called the cloud, meaning that it's on the internet, it's saved on the internet, and um, you can get to it. Now, you know, whether you have some issues with security, you have to look into that. There's some options to deal with that. But um, either uploading it to something like Google Docs or backing it up to um, some type of um, online backing up service, um, you are going to, um, um, you know, set yourself up um, to, you know, ensure that you're not, a, it's an insurance policy. It's going to make sure that you're not you're going to be ready for um, anything that happens because your computer your laptop can and does get stolen you know there are fires you know and there's there are viruses that may wipe out your whole system it happens so um, you want to make sure that um, you know you take those preventative measures so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video um, on document retention if you have any questions you can go ahead and um, again get at me at denontechhelp.com or you can come check out my twitter page at denontechhelp see you see you with the next video